Good morning YouTubers, Biker Bites here on an absolutely freezing Monday morning Brisbane commute I kid you not, it is freezing not literally freezing, but like for Brisbane this is absolutely freezing Grass monkeys. Grass monkeys all round, please, sir. Crazy. It was like seven degrees or something when I got up. And it's probably about 10 or 11 right now it's like way below average this wind is just like slicing me up oh man I'm actually I'm literally shivering literally shivering Ah, oh, excuse if I sniff. Well, anyway, the uh, cowie got a lot of love last night or yesterday, or I should say over the weekend. Give it a damn fine clean and relube the chain. Not only did I relube the chain, I relube the chain twice. I'll tell you why. The first time. I lubed the chain after cleaning the bike spotless I sprayed it on and realized this shit is white it was like spraying white paint all over my chain and sprocket I thought what the heck I thought maybe it just got like lots of tiny air bubbles but no so then I had a look and uh, thought well maybe just because it's not dry and it will dry clear uh, no so I looked at the can Penrite premium chain oil white white who the heck would want to spray their chain white for God's sake white anyway it left shit all over my bike looks stupid and horrible so uh, I had to get an older barn and get another can and this time make sure it was clear I mean I never knew you could get white chain oil why the heck would you want white I had no idea well, anyway, I know now, so I uh, got the clear stuff, uh, re cleaned, degreased, or yeah, the chain again, and uh, put this on, and it's all looking clean and spotless now. Very nice indeed. So a happy ending. Oh dear. You're gonna have to forgive this sniffing. I am shivering like a jelly. ridiculously cold Brisbane what are you doing anyway I went for a little burnout on the bike on Saturday if you remember my Friday video I was talking about looking at adventure adventure tours adventure sports well I mentioned to Benelli I was gonna have a look at and indeed I did I went out and had a test drive I'll insert a clip here Anyway, it was, uh, yeah, very interesting. And 
and as I thought it was pretty tall I was on tippy toes so I'm not sure how comfortable I'd feel on it as a daily commuter filtering through traffic and all that like because you want to be able to plant your foot firmly on the ground really when you're filtering traffic in case you uh, you know get into a situation I don't want the bike leaning over too far especially if you're between cars and wing mirrors and stuff but great ride it was the Benelli TRK Amazonas 1130cc Very nice 2012 or 13 it was One owner, only like less than 3k on the clock Never used it side of the road you are so it's a good bike like I say my only reservation is uh, feet on the ground Apart from that, I liked it. Nice, high, upright seating position. Oi, what the fuck you do that for? Stupid woman. And I don't mean that in a derogatory way, ladies. I would have said stupid bloke. So yeah, quite a fun weekend. It's only a 40, you're only going there, baby on board, what the frig, it's not a license to drive like a nutter, Whee! thank you brakes, ah, people are wearing scarves, are actually cold oh ooh, I just remembered I got some winter gloves I think I might have to swap Okay, well, that's all for me. Work. Nice. All right, don't forget, if you like the video, please click the uh, thumbs up, like button. 
And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe for this and other interesting videos of me out and about on my motorcycle. Ciao.